it is the moment all Sycamore fans have been counting down towards since that cold day in January when Kurt Mowry was named the head coach of Indiana State. That's the start of the Kurt Mallory era. And tonight, it gets underway against a familiar opponent at Eastern Illinois. It's the first time since 2009 that this historic rivalry is renewed. Fritz Seaton, the Kurt Mallory, Indiana State Sycamores take the field. Your keys to victory tonight for Indiana State, my friend. Well, I really think Coach hit on it. You know, you've got to win in the trenches and be really good up front. You got to eliminate mistakes. Do the things that you're capable of doing to the best of your ability. As Mitch Kimball goes under the center of Luis Vallopa, goes back to pass, looking pressured, and he will be dragged down by a pack of blue jersey tops. And what a way to start for Indiana State. The line of scrimmage, Harker hands it off to him. Booker's got a crease. He comes to the near side numbers. He's at the 50, first down and more, and into Eastern Illinois territory. First down, Indiana State. Booker with a fist pump to the crowd. Snap, Harker rolls out left side, looks back to his right. Booker's wide open. He's got an open field in front of him. Touchdown, Indiana State. Booker rushing all the way to the end zone. Isaac Harker with the touchdown pass. And with 10.01 on the clock, the Kurt Mallory era for Indiana State starts with a bang. Goes off the left side and he's into the end zone. Touchdown, Eastern oh, Illinois. Give the Panthers a lot of credit. Sycamores came out and hit him in the mouth in their second offensive possession. Panthers are able to go right back down the field. Parker from the gun will throw deep down the field. And it's intercepted with the interception for Eastern Illinois is Williams. And Williams is still on his feet far sideline to 15-10 and will stroll into the end zone. Somehow, Mark Williams was able to finagle his way from a pack of blue jerseys. 13 unanswered points for Eastern Illinois. But Indiana State has to settle for a field goal at the five yard line for the Sycamores. It is 16-13 as two Jerry Nunez field goals right now are the low points here in the second half of this contest. 16-13, you can hear the Sycamore faithful. We hope you are standing at home as well. Third and 13, Kimball with the snap, pressured, brought down in the backfield, huge sack by Indiana State. Defense has just been terrific here in the second half for ISU, Luke. They've done their job time and time and time again. Sparks under center. Booker right behind him. They hand it off to the senior. Booker right-handed stiff bar towards the pylon. Touchdown, Indiana State! Lamont Booker with his second touchdown of the night with 4.54 stopped on the clock. Eastern Illinois needs a touchdown. Indiana State just needs to hold him out of the end zone. Waist high snap, Kimball. And he's sacked! Brought down! 27 seconds left. Eastern Illinois's got to hurry. Eight seconds left, 20 to 16. One, maybe two plays for Eastern. Kimball from the gun, looks the throw, goes towards the end zone, caught, touchdown Eastern Illinois with three seconds left on the clock. Kurt Mallory era begins with a heartbreaking loss.